moment I'm on this job, I'm doing a bit of carpentry for somebody, I'm making some units that are going either side of a chimney breast and here's my progress so far and I've drilled a couple of holes in the wall to secure the unit and the wall is absolutely solid. I've got my DeWalt uh, combi drill so it's got a hammer drill on there but it's just not man enough so um, yeah I went out this morning and I got myself this. Oh yeah, went and bought myself an SDS drill. Woo! Yeah, check this out. <laughs> hey, what's up guys? It's your main man JB back once again with another product and kind of review on that product. As I've said already, I've just purchased this SDS drill, DeWalt SDS drill. Oh yeah, I'm really, really pleased. I've got a really, really good deal with this. As I've said already, I've got some really tough wool to drill into. I've got to put some wool plugs in there and some fixings and uh, using my combi drill, it just wasn't doing it and I don't want to really burn it out. So, bought myself this and uh, check it out. Got myself a charger. I've already got one of these, but well, I've got two now, so that's good. I can have two charging at the same time. And I've got another two four amp batteries. That is absolutely brilliant. So I've got a nice uh, stash of big four and five amp batteries now. So I've got two four amp batteries with this drill. And here is the drill itself. Oh yeah, look at that, nice. Let's just stick that battery in there for a minute so you can see what it looks like with it on. There we go, rather sexy that is, isn't it? Brushless, 18 volt XR brushless SDS drill. Three settings on there, so you can have the drilling, you can have hammer drill and you can just have hammer actions. You can drill into wood and metal, you can drill into masonry and you can also chisel into masonry as well. So you've got three different functions on there. You've got a forward and reverse switch there. Other than that, that's about it really. Here, let's give you a slightly closer look. Just get that in the light there. There we go, nice battery. It's got quite a long body and I was looking at another one which is a very compact small one but you know actually I'm quite happy with this the fact that I've got two 4 amp batteries now I got this for 199 oh yes 199 these batteries cost about 50 pounds each so really a brushless I've got a brushless SDS drill um, cordless brushless SDS drill for 100 pounds so that was pretty good. Um, got a nice handle on here. That's always helpful, isn't it, when pushing into the wall. And we can just undo it here and then we can move it into whatever position we want. And then got a little switch here, which is obviously for this like ruler, depth gauge. So, whoop, so when you are, oh, where's it gone? There it is, so when you are drilling, into the wall you can obviously set that so you know kind of exactly how deep to go or you can get it as deep as you want it set that and it's got quite an easy push button there and then just releases and that locks so that's really nice that'll come in handy because quite often I'll put a bit of masking tape around the drill bit so Let's just take that out for a minute so it doesn't get in our way. So there are your three settings and so you've got just drilling and you've got hammer drill and then you've just got hammer action. So uh, well pleased with this. It is SDS so it means you can only fit one type of drill in there. Obviously you can get different sizes and different bits but it has to be the same shank that goes into the actual drill. Now this is model DCH033 just in case you want to know the exact model and this is going to be absolutely perfect for what I need it for. 
I'm not going to be using this every day or 24 hours a day, just the occasional job when I've got a bit of a solid wall and I have come across a solid wall now and then and I've used my combi drill but this is just going to make it so much easier, that's for sure. Now you do get, oh look, look how nicely that sits, I haven't put it down like that yet, that is brilliant won't sit down like that, probably don't want to, we well, could put it on the side, but actually it sits quite nicely like that, doesn't it? Cool. So you get this tea stack box, which is a little bit different to the other tea stack boxes. So it hasn't got the handle on top here. It's built well, and uh, it will go with the other tea stack boxes. So I've got one just here. So this is the box that I got with my multi-tool, but I put all my drill bits and stuff in here. As you can see, I've got spade bits, spare batteries, and drill bits, and driver bits. So just put that one on top, and then there we go. You can lock them both together. So brilliant, part of the T-Stack, the T-Stack crew. Um, but as I say, the only thing it hasn't got is the handle on top like this one has. Now this isn't too heavy. I believe the weight of this is actually three kilos with a battery on it, which is not a lot really. You know, when you've got two hands on it, that's, that's no problem at all. So, uh, yeah, it's not going to fatigue your arms. So let's just pull the trigger. So look, it's not moving. So that's just on the hammer action there. Now I haven't got any chisel bits. Uh, I'm not going to be doing any uh, kind of chasing out or taking tiles off or trying to break up any concrete just yet. But I did pick myself up a fairly cheap but good reviews on these drill bits. So in here I've got a 5mm or 6mm or two six mils, one short, one long, and then I've got an eight and a 10. So they're gonna be perfect for what I need. So let's open these up. And just in case you're not familiar with SDS drills, um, I'll give you a little look at them and how they actually go into the drill. I did look at more expensive sets, but this one had good reviews and I'll see how I go with these and if I need to get more at a later date then I will do so. So here we go, let's have a look at this. So that's how the end of an SDS drill looks. It's got these kind of grooves and slots in it. So basically all you do with this is just spin it and it locks in like that. That's all ready to go now. Let's just put that on hammer action. It's like something of Texas Chainsaw Massacre or something, isn't it? <laughs> just the way that that's vibrating and it's not even hitting the wall yet. That's a uh, that's going to have some serious hammer action, I reckon. So I've only got these masonry bits. That's all I've got for now. And uh, if you want to take it out, it's really simple. It's very similar to a, a impact driver where you literally just pull this back and you can pull it out. Actually, the impact driver, you have to put it that way. But, you know, hey, very simple, really quick change. You haven't got to worry about even a chuck. You know, the keyless chuck, you can just do that. You haven't even got to worry about that. So that is great. We can put it on normal drilling. So if you want to just put a wood or metal bit in there, you can do. So brilliant stuff. I like these little stubby ones that I got as well, because actually that's probably all I'm going to need to go into the wall with. Although I think I will need a six or seven mil. I think it was a seven mil. That's all right seven or eight, something like that, but they're going to be absolutely ideal. Right, let's see this sucker in action.
Well, that sure did make easy work of those holes, didn't it? And I did have quite a few to drill as well. So, uh, nice one, absolutely brilliant. Now, what I will do if I get some chisel bits for this, I'll do another video on using those when I eventually get round to actually needing them for a job. So, uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. If you've got any questions, leave those in the comments box below. I kept it short and sweet on this one, but uh, what you see is what you get, really. Um, another quality DeWalt 18 volt XR brushless tool. Huh. Nice. So thanks for watching guys. Remember to subscribe. That would be absolutely fantastic if you're not already a subscriber. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Just let other people know that you enjoyed it and hopefully they'll click on it and they'll enjoy it. Fantastic. I'm done. I'm out of here. So I'll see you on the next video.